Hello there everybody, and welcome to the 11th episode of TPL Approvals Season 8. And for today's approval, I am going to be doing an approval to Foxy the Fox 110, the TPL fans rant on one of the number one most worstest user ever in 2024 that cannot be trusted or forgiven, called Vinny the criminal, pervert, pedophile, racist, disgusting, offensive, unforgivable, untrustable, CP sharer, COVID-19 and death threat sender, doxer, go animate slash viant fanboy, hypocrite, wrongdoing denier, falsifier of facts, personal information sender, a biggest hater of age of consent, victim card player, innocent card player, criticism card player, and a heartless jerk who doesn't deserve any friends or any futuristic cars, and deserves 350,000 haters and only 23 fans and needs to have a very old and dirty ass car from the 1700s and whose nose is always growing big like Pinocchio from the 1940s Disney movie of it. And in this video, I am portraying as Mara Legends, aka the smiling assassin from the Chase Australia. Because she made her first appearance to that game show back in 2022, and she really looks so beautiful according to her hairstyle. Oh boy oh boy, I am very excited to see this rant video of hers. Since she had some awesome reasons to hate that user that shall never ever 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 be trusted or forgiven at all or in any future years at any cost. Now, let us now roll up to this awesome and spectacular rant video. Lights, camera, action. What's up? It's me, Boxy the Box, 110 a TPL fan, and welcome to Boxy's Vance. Season 1, Episode 9. And this rant is going to be on Dark Mega Red Ultra Fire 15 461. <laughs> now, anyways, before I get started, I just want to say if you like this user or neutral this user, well, I highly suggest that you guys cut ties with him because. He can't be trusted or supported because he's a pedophile. Yeah, I so much 100% agree with you massive huge time. Dark Omega Red Ultra Fire should never ever 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 be supportable, defendable, trusted, respectable, lovable, likable, trustworthy, or forgivable at any cost, because of all of that bullshit he did from his so-called past in the first place. And yes, Foxy, in case if you didn't know, if you didn't know that there were these words called supportable, defendable, respectable, the app called ChatGPT has definitions of those three words that Vinny shouldn't be that I mentioned there. So, for the first word, supportable means capable of being defended or justified. For the second word, defendable means capable of being supported or upheld, especially in terms of evidence, reasoning, or resources. And finally, respectable means deserving of respect or admiration, often due to being morally upright, competent, or of good quality. And yeah, Vinny Shore is a biggest pedophile next to Mango HTF Animations who groomed a minor. I cannot believe Vinny just shared CP back in some time in the 2020s, sent a stock image of a private part to an 11-year-old on Discord, and supported pedophilia by hating age of consent. This is just extremely fricked up of Vinny the Pooh. And yes, that mock name I came up with literally reminds me of the character from the Disney franchise, Winnie the Pooh. And I do not like the horror movie of Winnie the Pooh. And I am not excited for the next one to come in February 2025, which is on my brother's birthday month. And yeah, the only horror movies, cartoons, and TV series I like are The Purge, The Purge Election Year, Child's Play, Child's Play 2, Monster House, Coraline, Corpse Bride, Frankenweenie, Goosebumps, Goosebumps Haunted Halloween, Ghost Hunters, etc. Anyways, 
Let's continue with the approval. Now, anyways, let's get started with the rant. Dark Omega Red Ultra Fire 15461. Oh my god, this user sucks. And I'll give the reasons why. Reason number one. Back in December of 2022, he wished a school shooting happy anniversary like Yeah, that was totally very heartless and disrespectful of him to those ones who sadly deceased at the Sandy Hooks Elementary School shooting. And also, that is also very fricked up of him to do such heartless and disrespectful thing. Shame on him. Shame on him. Please, dude, that's very disrespectful to the people who died during the school shooting. <laughs> like, seriously, dude, not cool. Reason number two, he's a pedophile because he made a community help post saying share this post if you hate age consent. I know, right? And that easily proved that he supports pedophilia. Age of consent is always here in every need, not in to hate it. Let's prove she hates age of consent. Like, seriously, dude, age consent is here for a reason. And this proves you're a pedophile. And the next example on how he's a pedophile is that he shared a stock image of pirate parts to a minor in Discord. What the fuck? Are you actually out of your mind, Vinny? Why the hell would you send an 11 year old a stock image of a private part on Discord? You know damn well that that is extremely disgusting. This proves that you, Vinny, are a pedophile. Sending someone a disgusting image even when someone is underage or are in kids slash children's age has got to be one of the worst thing you have ever done. You should never ever 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 do that ever. Because that counts as pedophilia. Like, seriously dude, that's honestly disgusting of you. Reason number three. He's a hypocrite. For example, he claims he hates pedophiles, yet he's a pedophile himself. Wow, what a hypocrite. Reason number four. <laughs> he denies his wrongdoing so many times. Reason number five. I mean, reason number five. He can't handle the truth about himself. That is so extremely true. Because, like for example, when Chucky exposed him for saying the offensive words and saying that school shootings are based, he said, no I didn't. Listen here Vinny, you actually did say offensive words and say that school shootings are based. School shootings are not based at all. They are terrible and very sad. Reason number six. He's a doxer because he doxed two minors and he even doxed my the high school that I went to. I know, right? That was very fricked up of him to do that. Because doxing someone is very illegal and very dangerous. Because people can expose you if you call some users you hate by their real names, their email addresses, their school name, their phone numbers, and even worse, their house address. And thank God that Vinny didn't dox my real name. Because I would have felt pissed the frick off if he ever did that. I would totally lose it and turn my face red and have steam in my ears. That was on my friend Chuck in the comment section one one of Chuck's community poses, but that channel of his sadly got terminate we sadly got terminated. But at least Chuck still has another channel and a second new second channel just in case. Reason number seven. He made a 
I think it was like a car crash or something, image of a minor, which is SG, SG, whichever at the time. Reason number eight. Whenever we call him out on call him out on his bad actions, he denies it. Yeah, that is so very true. Like for example, whenever we call him out for doxing someone, he just says no he doesn't when he actually did. Last but not least, reason number nine. <clears throat> He's one of the most annoying users on YouTube. Oh yes, definitely. And not only this, but Vinny really needs to get off the internet and never comes back again. End of rant. Now anyways, that's the end of the rant, and hope you guys enjoyed it, and I'll uh, see you guys in my next video. Foxy the Fox, 110, the TPL fan, out. Wow, this rant of hers was so amazing, because she had some truthful reasons to hate Vinny that shall never ever be trusted. So anyways, this is the end of this approval. Thank you all for watching. Until then, over and out.